On today's episode of the Who Am I series, we're going to be discussing the case of the Mecklenburg County John Doe. The Mecklenburg County John Doe was found on November 21st, 2009 in Clarksville, Virginia. The remains were not recognizable due to decomposition. The Thompson's death was two weeks prior to discovery. The cause of death was homicide by blunt force trauma to the head. The Mecklenburg County John Doe was a white male who's estimated to have been between 35 to 45 years old, although his age range might be much broader at 25 to 50 years old. He's estimated to have stood between 5 foot 4 and 5 foot 8 inches tall with a slender to medium build and to have weighed between 110 and 125 pounds. Investigators were unable to determine his eye and hair color. The most notable feature of John Doe is a tattoo of a Doberman Pinscher's head with the inscription Capone 2-14-92 on his right shoulder. Some sources report the tattoo as being on his left shoulder. It's been speculated that Capone is the name of the tattoo artist as opposed to the Doberman. Also, some have pointed out that the tattoo was most likely done by an amateur tattoo artist as an effort to cover up a scar or another tattoo. At least one of his teeth had a filling in it. Also, several of his teeth were fractured, but it's unclear whether this happened during his life or after his death. Dental records, fingerprints, and DNA are available. The Mecklenburg County John Doe was found wearing size small white underwear, Levi blue jeans in size W30L30, a canvas belt, white socks, and size 9 black Nike Air Alvord tennis shoes. He was also wearing a white or yellow metal necklace. John Doe was found floating in Kerr Lake in Clarksville, Mecklenburg County, Virginia. The site is located near the North Carolina border. Due to the recognizable nature of the tattoo and the relatively small population of Clarksville, it's highly probable that he was not a local resident. Online sleuths have researched a potential connection between John Doe and the county line registered Dobermans, a Doberman breeder in Alberta, Canada that was founded in 1992 and active until sometime in October 2009. Their first stud was named Capone. It's possible that he was an employee of the company, Capone's show handler, or a family member of the owner. It's also been theorized that John Doe worked at a veterinarian's office and the tattoo is in remembrance of one of the practice's patients. Authorities have continued working to identify him and the list of exclusions now tops 1,200. If you have any information that can help authorities identify the Mecklenburg County John Doe, I urge you to come forward to help his family reclaim him and put him to rest. Thank you for watching.